As we shade under our own trees, large or small, we reflect on moments and events in our lives. On a visit to Egypt, as I left the traditional mosque, I glanced back and saw this image of a Muslim praying. Inscribed on the wall is the simple divine name of God in Arabic, Allah. I was immediately struck by the simplicity of Islam. A memorizer of the entire Quran, Sheikh Muhammad Ali, is also known as the master of the times. This title is given to special people who are able to tell when the time of any of the five daily prayers has arrived, without the aid of any device other than a stick and the length of its shadow. We spent three days and nights in this remote place in the desert, nights in which the winds blew and covered us with a thin layer of sand. Meanwhile, Sheikh Abdul Rahman prayed. The old wall of Rabat holds a particular fascination for me. I sat in a cafe as the sun began its descent. I used the gate as stage left and the lamp post as stage right. Eventually, a man in traditional attire entered the setting. I knew then what I had been waiting for. During my travels through Sudan, I was taken to the Munna Salamat Al Dawa school. I was completely won over by the vibrancy of the school children and the amazing atmosphere within the school. I hope I captured some of it in this portrait of the girls. While photographing the River Nile one evening, I looked around and saw these three boys closely watching me. I noticed each one was a different shade of brown, and when I asked them their names, I was told Abu Bakr, Omar and Ali were the names of three of the closest companions to the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, 14 centuries ago. Built by the Prophet Abraham, peace be upon him, the Kaaba is illuminated by the light of the people who go round it. On my first visit in 1971, I was immediately struck by its size. It completely filled my vision. On the eve of the Eid festival, I found myself placed on one of the highest buildings in Mecca. The holy city was filled to the brim with worshippers. The unbroken mass of people stretched as far as the eye could see. They appeared like one body. <laughs> Beneath the canopy of the Green Dome lies the burial place of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Loved by Muslims the world over, Medina the Illuminated holds a special place within the hearts of the believers. Tick tock to the rhythm of life. While visiting the ancient city of Xi'an in China, I was taken through the narrow streets to visit a school for children aged from two to six. I waited some time while they got the children ready and then they all appeared before me dressed in their best clothes. For 45 minutes, they enthusiastically recited Quran, sang songs, and utterly mesmerized me. The faces of these children were inspirational. <laughs> <laughs> 